Good morning to the VCT. Welcome to the tribe. So I got up pretty early, about 7 o'clock, drank a couple cups of coffee here in my cheetah mug. Still leaner than Joey Carbstrong. And I just got off the toilet, like literally just got off the toilet, and I had a, an amazing ghost wipe. I love ghost wipes. And for those of you that don't know what ghost wipes are, it's one of the benefits of going vegan. And I basically can get off the toilet without wiping my ass. Theoretically, I would be able to get off the toilet without wiping my ass. But I do anyways, just to check, just to make sure, and get that validation, uh, you know, first thing in the morning that I got a, a nice, solid ghost wipe, no mess. My digestive tract is, is super efficient. It just feels really, really good. You know, when you wipe and there's absolutely nothing there, your butthole's nice and dry. Um, you know, just one of the many benefits of going vegan. So today, we're going up to campus. I do have one class. I'm going to go meet with one of my subscribers. She said that she's been subscribed to my channel for a little while, and she wants to make the transition into going vegan. And she uh, asked if she could meet up with me and sit down and talk for you know a few minutes. So that's what we're going to do today. So let's get started. So I am walking to the bus station so that I can get to school. It's a little windy, but it's beautiful. It's actually really warm. And for February, like it's February 4th now, with no snow on the ground, no snow in sight, it's probably just around the corner. We'll probably get hit this weekend or maybe next week or something. You never know in Syracuse. But it's really nice to get this kind of weather because we usually don't. And I know it looks kind of cloudy and gray, but the actual temperature is very warm for February. So we're going to make a little detour. I'm actually going to catch the bus at 10.05 instead of 9.25. Can you guess where we're at? Can you guys guess where we are? It's one of my favorite places. What do you guys think? Yas. We're going to the library. I'm going to go upload. So I just uploaded the video. Here we go. Go check it out on my main. So I'm waiting for my computer class, and then after that, I get out at about 12.15. I'm supposed to meet her at about 1, so if she feels comfortable, um, I'll invite her to appear on the vlog, and uh, we can just talk a little bit. But if not, I'll just let you guys know how it went. So I went to class. Um, it was actually excruciating to get through. I feel like I'm learning nothing in computer class because I already know everything she's teaching. So that's kind of frustrating, Just, but it's a requirement. I've got to take the course to graduate. Oops. But it's just frustrating because like, I already know everything she's talking about. You know, I know how to set up a computer. I know the difference between a Mac and a PC. Like, it's just basic stuff, you know? But I did meet up with a subscriber. Um, she's really nice. Her name is Kay. And I didn't want to like be too intrusive and ask her to come on the uh, the vlog today. But she said she would be open to, you know, meeting up with me so we could, you know, do do a YouTube video so I could introduce you guys to her. She seems really nice, and she just had a lot of questions about like what to eat, um, you know, where to get protein, what kind of like junk food or fast food is vegan, if any. Like, just she just had a lot of questions. And I'm gonna grab a sample of that. Nice. Andrew wants some of my mozzo crackers. How's your avocado? It's delicious. Want to try it? Mm hmm. No, I'm good. But I kind of broke it down for her and told her like what it is I do, what works for me. She also has diabetes, which does make it uh, like I didn't want to give her any bad advice, so it makes it a little bit harder to know for sure what would be okay and what wouldn't be okay for her. But, uh, Andrew, would you be would you be comfortable in, in telling somebody that had diabetes to Not exactly, consider a but vegan I feel diet? like, you know, there's nothing that can harm a diabetic from a vegan diet, but there are some things maybe they want to take into consideration. Don't diabetics need, like, a certain amount of sugar? Yeah, uh-huh. So I didn't just want to automatically say... Yeah, do high carb, you know, start consuming as many carbohydrates as you want because I don't want, you know, I don't want her to get sick. But it was really cool to meet her in person, to meet somebody that's been watching me. She said she was really excited when she saw in my vlogs and saw on my channel and stuff that I was going to Onondaga Community College. And actually one of her friends on campus watches my channel too. So that's really cool to know that people like around me, around town, 
are watching. Uh, so I'm headed home now. And uh, carving up. Yeah, we're just carving up. I did 30 minutes on the bike. What'd you do, Andrew? I was just some chest. Some chest? Weightless. Some like bitch weights, right? He puts 10 pounds off, like on each side. I 10 haven't pounds. worked on the free weights in a while, so that's why. When's the last time you've done free weights? <laughs> like months. So he's like trying to do an incline bench press, and he's got, he starts with 25, so he's like, that's way too heavy. So he took the 25s off and he put 10 pounds on. But man, you know, cooking. I know. I was trying to get you. I was trying to get you in the shot too. Let's keep it like that. That's crooked, man. So, uh, yeah. I don't know how you just stand and sit there and eat an apple. I don't know how you fucking think avocados are good post workout meals. It's awesome. Like he's been in the gym for like 40 minutes and he's gonna, gonna have an avocado. This is like a dream fruit, dude. Are avocados considered fruits? Yeah. They are? I consider them vegetables, but they're considered fruits. But are they fruits? I didn't, I don't know. Usually I think a fruit is being kind of sweeter, you know what I mean? Shit but, blows me out of the water. So. Yeah, man, like, I don't know. The broadcasts are going a little bit slow. How was your stream? Mine was good. I had like 20 people, which is nice. Well, that's cool. That's well, I think just the, the fresh setting and, yeah. and, you know, something different. It's hard to do that when you're at the same place all the time, but... Yeah, I'm between about 10 and 20 people, but, like... You were on you now too, so that's a different I was on you now, yeah, and I was in my own hashtag. I started the vegan hashtag, but I'd like to get to the point where I'm pulling in 50 people in my broadcast, you know what I mean? 100, as many as I can, but... A little frustrated, like I said, with the YouTube channels. I've said that a couple times. You know, I gain subs and I lose them. You know, I want to put out content views, though, every that's day. That's the most important thing is to get views. I know, but now my views are starting to sink again. You know what I mean? It's like as soon as I start making normal videos, yeah, don't worry everybody about disappears, you know? So, I might have to start some more drama, call somebody out. Are you going to call out me? No, I wouldn't do that for you. Maybe a glucose network. What if you called out, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to think of somebody worth calling out. Um, you should make a video about how Ben and Jerry's made vegan ice cream. That's a big thing right now. We got to do it either tonight or tomorrow, though. It's going to be irrelevant. I want to just make a video and be like, hey, Ben and Jerry's got vegan ice yeah, cream. Yeah, share your idea. You don't like ice cream, though, so you probably wouldn't be the best person. To you'd probably be like, too many fats in it, even though it's vegan. Well, that would be correct, probably. But, no, I want to start doing taste tests. Oops. Yeah, yeah, we should do that. Do taste tests and uh, BuzzFeed questions and challenges. You know, just more mainstream stuff. I'm open to doing more mainstream stuff, you know. So, all right, well, we're going to hit the road. Go get the plane in the van. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. Please do give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my vlog channel here. I put out new videos, like, almost every single day. And uh, sub to my main channel. I'll leave the link in the description below. You want to uh, take us out with the, the line? From uh, Earth to Infinity, that one. Until next time. Yeah. You just butcher that, but... Yeah, you just put your, what's your line? All right, I'll say it. May the stars be aligned in your favor from Earth to infinity. Until Peace. next time, keep it curvy. Keep it curvy, you said. <laughs>